Hello guys, welcome again to Protein Master Base of Nairobi. This is your friend Kim. Uh, it's been long, long time guys before we uh, did this video, before I sharing through this media with you guys. I've missed you guys. I've missed just doing a video for you guys and uh, that's the sole purpose I'm here, just to try samples for you guys and uh, be able to share with, with you. And uh, last time we did, uh, last time we did uh, some few samples and uh, we, we've been waiting for the results and uh, it's so simple uh, why I'm saying this is because uh, I believe BSF is a game changer for farmers you guys who are doing chicken uh, uh, farming you are doing uh, 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 fish farming even uh, uh, pigs and uh, dairy BSF is a game changer please let's get to it in all simplicity no matter how uh, small your farm is or your area is, you can be able to do it. There is enough waste to do BSF. We can be able to do it. Let's bring this thing together. Why, 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 need, why am I saying this? I'm saying this because, uh, look at this. For you to be able to have protein in your, in your meal, uh, in your dairy meal, uh, whatever food you're feeding your, your chicken with or something, you need to have uh, protein. Uh, protein we get mostly from the fish mills and uh, from soya and all these. Your area you don't have an, a, a river or nature to get uh, the, the fish mills, but you can be able to raise be yourself, and your chicken can be able to feed on these. Very good. Your uh, 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 the egg yolk comes out very good. Very nice meat. The growth is very fast. You're talking about 40 to 45 percent of protein here. So guys, it's possible to do this. So please do it. You've got a lot of waste around there. So you better do it. So back to our results. Uh, we've been waiting. For, we have waited for it uh, for too long. We did it on the eighth, and uh, today is twenty fourth. I believe that's uh, sixteen days. And uh, I waited too long because I wanted to see the results after fifteen days. So yesterday was fifteen days. Today is the sixteenth day. So let's see. Let's see it. Let's see it. Just get a closer look. Uh, our first crate here. We did, we did it on the 8th, and uh, that's on the 8th, uh, 2020, exactly that way. That that was a uh, cow dung, exactly. And then this other one on the same day was uh, uh, cow dung and uh, potatoes. Uh, this other one was cow dung and chicken, and that, that this other one was chicken and uh, 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 chicken droppings alone chicken droppings alone so that's it we did four and they sound like uh, an order you're doing in the cafeteria chicken droppings and something else so why why did I do this uh, most of you guys are, have been telling me I have a lot of cow dung I have a lot of these and uh, I always say we need to help we need to try it and uh, we, we have been trying it and uh, the first one I did uh, cow dung plus uh, wheat bran and maize jam the results were fine or perfect it was good but now again I thought if I tell you again guys we'll be putting wheat bran and maize jam remember we are trying to cut cost so if I tell you again put wheat bran again I'm taking you back again to the cost so I thought can I try do it with uh, potato peelings and uh, and, uh, and uh, cow dung so we tell just to do all these. So let's let, let's take the first one. The first one is uh, cow dung alone. Cow dung alone. These are the results. Just get it closer. So I don't like the results because if you can look look here, we still have tiny ones. And uh, look at the cow dung itself. It's not even dry yet. And. Uh, they're not bad but not good this should not be the result i was expecting them to be a little bit bigger this is not this should not be the result so for me what what i'll say uh, about the cow dung alone now uh it's 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 okay with me i can i can confidently say cow dung alone no cow dung alone no i'd say no uh what we've been doing uh throughout the week the two weeks I, I, i've been turning it uh, uh like this when we turn it this way, we are trying to oxygenate it uh, and allow some oxygen in and that they may be able to eat very well. 
So as they say, cow dung too much fiber. I totally, I think I, I agree. I agree with this now, because the results after two after six after six, sixteen days, no good. This other one is uh, cow dung and uh, potato peelings. So again, let's get a, a look. It's much better. Uh, you can uh, get a, a, a closer look. This is much better. Uh, maybe we can just uh, see it. We miss this much better. This much better. Let me let me turn it again. I think this much better. This one. This much better. Uh, you can see now cow dung alone. They still we still have tiny ones. Uh, cow dung plus potato peelings. Much better. I, I'll give it. I'll give it as. I, I'll give it as sixty-five percent. Uh, there's something else I noted here. For it to be much better, to be maybe like eighty or ninety percent. I think you need to uh, to increase your potato peelings more and less cow dung. Remember, I did eight eight kg of of of, uh, of cow dung and two of uh, potatoes. But now, I th but what 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 I would say. I would say now reduce on the cow dung, increase on the potatoes. Reduce on the cow dung, increase on the potatoes. That will be good. So cow dung plus potatoes are plus. But now increase, increase the potatoes. And the other one is uh, cow dung and chicken. Let's let let's have a look at it. Again. Uh, it's it's okay but uh, not that good not that good I'll give it maybe uh, 65 also no 65 I'll give it I'll give it a, a 60 uh, that that combination didn't work very well I'll give it a 60 so again uh, cow dung and chicken I give it a 60%. No, 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 not that good. Not that good. So let's see the other one. The other one is uh, chicken alone. Chicken droppings alone. Here they are. Chicken droppings alone. Uh, these, these, these are, I would uh, give them uh, 70 these are, I'll give it a 70. Uh, it's, it's not that bad. It's not that bad, but not really the result I was expecting for the chicken. But this one, I'll give it a 70. Uh, because the, the, there's another one I did for the chickens, because I believe chicken, uh, for the chickens, uh, they always bring out, give out very big ones, like this one. I don't know if they can have a, a closer look at them. Something like that. You see, these are a little bit bigger, a little bit bigger. But uh, this, this is a different one. So this, was, this is not the part of our, our results. So, but I was expecting the chicken droppings to give us a bigger one. But uh, maybe what I got was not uh, very good. But still, I'll give it a, a 70. I'll give it a 70. So this result, this after 16 days, and we've been able to get that. So, cow, cow dung alone, that I said no. Uh, I, can't, I can't put a plus on that one because uh, it has not performed very well. Cow dung potatoes, I give it a 65. And uh, something I've learned with it, increase the potato peelings here, or the potatoes you have, and less of cow dung. Maybe, let's say, you can do uh 60 percent uh potato peelings and then maybe like 40 or, or do 70 potatoes and maybe 30 uh cow dung. and these cow dung and and and, and uh, chicken are uh, not very good it, it, it didn't work well for me for the chicken it's okay so guys those are the results i i hope you've learned something i hope you're gonna do something with it i hope they're going to help you somewhere uh but we'll keep on doing more guys uh more tests for you guys and uh
we we hoping for the better. We believe in something in something good is, is going to come out of this. Why we are doing this as Protein Master is because we want to help every farmer. We want to be able to be uh, you guys to be uh, have a farm that sells sustainable by itself. You be able to get your protein in the farm. We'll be doing something different very soon. Uh, we we want to come up something different with something called Azola. So we want we will be showing you guys very soon. We want to do something that in the same farm you can be able to get the plant protein in it and be, and still get the, the uh, uh, BSF here. We're talking about 45 uh, to 50 percent protein. That's good for you guys. So from Protein Master again, thank you so much even for taking your time to watch videos. Once again, please subscribe, like, share our videos. Tell the farmers who don't, don't know about this. We have had guys who come and say they, they saw us in the uh, like uh, uh, in a day, and the following day they were in our farm. We are still doing trainings uh, during when this uh, pandemic. Uh, we still are uh, doing trainings, and uh, we are following the guidelines and uh, all this. So don't be don't be afraid. Everything is well here, and uh, basically and mostly what I want to just encourage you guys share my videos. That's that, that's what you can do. Before you end, uh, before before you, uh, you put your phone down, please just press the share button, press the subscribe button also, and let's go viral. Let's go viral. Let's help another farmer. There's another farmer struggling somewhere who cannot be able to do it. Let's help them, and it's gonna be better. So again, from Protein Master, we said thank you so much. The Lord bless you, and shalom.